welcome to our culture workshop. Today, I will show you how to make a simple knot tape bracelet. Dan Dan, do you know why Asian Chinese people need this type of knotting? I guess for decoration or maybe for making clothes? Good guess. But actually, thousands of years ago, when Chinese characters hadn't been invented yet, people used to tie a knot to keep a record of the big events and important schedules happening for the tribe. They call it Jie Sheng Ji Shi. Wow, that's such a clever idea. Nowadays, knotting is mostly used as a decoration and is a traditional art which is still loved by Chinese people all over the country. Oh, the bracelet you're wearing, did you make that yourself? It's so pretty. Yes, let's learn how to make a bracelet together. Start with the shorter piece, placing it vertically on the table and use some tape to secure it. Then grab one of the longer pieces, hold it under the shorter piece, find the middle and then make a simple knot. Now please watch this next part carefully. We start with the right piece. Place it on top of the yellow piece. Then grab the left piece and place it on top like so. Then using the same piece, place it under the yellow piece and under the red piece. Then pull it to make a knot. Make sure it is nice and tight. Then we start from the left side. Repeating the same process. And pull it tight. Then we keep repeating the process until we have created enough knots. Remember to make sure each knot is tightened the same amount. This will ensure the bracelet has a nice shape and good symmetry. Using the tape to fix it to the table is easier for a beginner, but I will remove it here and show you the process more closely. The yellow string is the band of the bracelet. Now let's make the other side. Make a circle with the bracelet and use some tape to fix it to the table. Grab the remaining long string and place it under the yellow string. Find the middle and then make a simple knot. Hopefully you still remember how to do the knotting form before. Start from the right side, then the left side repeating the process. When you are nearly finished, you can put it on your wrist to check the size. Perfect! Now we add a round bead on each end and secure it with a knot. Cut all the areas which have excess string. Use a lighter to melt the material and secure it. Congratulations! You have now finished making a beautiful knotted bracelet. Here is the present I made for you. Thank you so much. Now I know how to make one as well. I hope you enjoyed today's workshop. See you next time.